At dawn, the extent of the damage comes to light. The roofs are gone, turned to rubble. Entire apartments blown to bits in the night by a Russian missile attack. On site, Lviv's mayor said some 60 apartments were damaged and nearly just as many cars. Rescue workers continued to sift through the broken blocks of concrete, looking for survivors and victims. People have been dug out from under the rubble. We're organizing all the necessary help. The situation is very complex. As you can see, there is very serious damage. We'll have to start repairing as soon as rescuers finish their work. On social media, President Vladimir Zelensky published these drone images, saying the attack was a consequence of Russian terrorists and that there would be a tangible response, a defiance repeated by the regional governor. As you can see, Russia's ultimate goal is to destroy the Ukrainian nation. But this war will go on until the last Ukrainian is standing. We will win. We will overcome. Located in western Ukraine, just 70 kilometers from the Polish border, such attacks are rare in Lviv. The last major bombing in the region dates back to March. Home to over 700,000 before the war, the city quickly became a place of refuge for thousands of Ukrainians escaping fighting further east. With this attack, the worst in Lviv's history, according to the mayor, that sense of safe haven has been shattered.